Hey everyone, it's me, Aries Mars, and I'm coming to you again with another story time. This story time is about the time my grandmother came over to my mother's house and ran off her boyfriend. Y'all ready? Okay. So a little backstory. My mother was um seeing this man, um, and him and I really didn't get along well. And I felt like my grandmother, she had some intuition about him. But when she came over that day, it was very explosive. So, picture it. It's sometime in the night. Okay, I'm in, I say, was I in elementary school at this time as well? Yeah, I was in elementary school at this time. Um, the reason why I can remember this event so clearly is because of uh, basically of what happened um, and then what happened afterwards um, when he left. So my grandmother comes over. Okay, she came over to talk to my mother. I don't know what they were talking had to, she had to talk to him about. Then when she saw him, she they totally went off on him. I don't know what for, what happened, but she totally went off on him, cussing him, calling him names, and telling him to get out. I don't know what happened. It's like as soon as she saw him, she went for him. I mean, she straight went for his jugular. <laughs> it, it was so bad he did he did pack um a bag and leave. He did leave. And in the way I felt about that, I was actually happy that he left. I was very happy he left. But I didn't show it on my face. I didn't show that I was happy he left. Because, you know, my mother I'm a young child, my mother's still in love with him. <laughs> Um, but with my grandmother doing all that, it kind of caused her to have a stroke. So she had to go to the hospital. Afterwards, <laughs> after he left and all that went down, <laughs> um, my mother packed us up in the car <laughs> to go over to his mother's house to talk to him. <laughs> I'm like, why? I don't really want him to come back. Why are we doing this? But I couldn't say something. I really couldn't say anything. That's my mother. Um, <laughs> so we went over to his mother's house. His mother's mad of because of what her mother did. Um, and then he's just in there, you know, sitting um, quiet, crying. So my mother goes and talks to him. And then basically makes us well makes me lie because <laughs> I really didn't want to I really didn't want to say what um he wanted to be said um you know which is we wanted him back <laughs> why I guess I loved my mother too much not to really show my true emotions as a child to have this man come back into our lives when I really didn't want him to. Like I said, me and him, you know, me and him had problems along the way, you know, which I will get into another story time about. Because um, I'm going to be touching on some things on him that I'm not trying to really put out on this one. So, but yeah, I'm going to make another story time about him and what he did to me and my sister and stuff like that <laughs> but guess what he came back i mean and what can i do i'm just a child following the directions of my mother but yeah i guess that's the end of this one <laughs> all right y'all <laughs> i'm out